guys, now today I'm going to show you how to create a simple um, third person, you know, controller set up in, in Uni. So, you know, I know Uni already has one, like, you know, third person controller, you know, but they have, like, you know, a simple, you know, like a constructor guy running around, but, you know, you can't really drag and drop in your models. And I've tried to, you know, have my own model set up, but it never worked, but, you know, until now. So but I figured out it must mess around with Unity. So, first thing you can do, you know, create a new scene, delete everything you else have. Um, delete your main camera because we won't need that now. So you can create, let's create like a a capsule cylinder, whichever one you want. Well, okay, let's bring this down a little bit to the floor. Um, okay, let's bring this down a little bit more. Okay, so now you're just gonna drag a character motor script that, that comes with the first person. So just drag the character motor to the capsule for your player. Um, right, so let's leave that there. Character motor comes with the character controller. Um, now it's going to have the mouse look one that comes with the character. First person character controller sources scripts. Let's bring that, drag that to the capsule. So the so person can see, move around, so mouse X. Sensitivity for X is 15, sensitivity for the Y is 0, negative 360, 360, we're going to have the 0 and 0. And then the most important thing is the FPS input. Okay, so type it, bring that to the capsule, because the most important thing. Now double click on the capsule. Can backspace. Um, double click on the capsule, game object, create camera. So there, so it's right on the camera, right on the player. So let's drag it about, make the X rotation around 20. Um, drag this up a little bit, like this. Yeah, like that's pretty good. Okay, now let's put the mouse look to here, to the camera. Um, we're gonna make this Y. Sensitivity is gonna be around 10, 10, 0. Yeah, 360, and negative 16, 1. Okay, so now we can, well, we don't have to rename it. You can rename it if you want. I'll just rename it uh, main camera. Main camera. Okay, so that's the capsule, main camera. We have the character controller, character motor, mouse look, and the FPS input. And the main camera with the mouse look script. Parent that to there. Let's test this out. Okay, so you can move around. We can go forward, you know. That's pretty good. Now, the thing that this looks like, if you look down here, we can look all the way down to the ground and run around. That's that's I don't want that. We don't want that. So we're gonna go to the capsule. Um, sorry, main camera. This 60. You can just change it to like 18, 14, 14. Another well, minimum Y. Oh yes, yeah, so that's a lot better. So you know, if you look down, it's not there. We don't need to change the X axis. So. Yeah, so this is basically it. It's nice and simple. And if you want, like, you know, I've, I've seen a lot of the games have it. Like, you know, if you can create another camera. Okay, no, first let's create, create a cube. Um, and go like this. Or I, I just remember something too. Um, right here. We don't have the camera, so we can't really see how look good this looks. Oops, just a little point or something, so we can see. Um, let's add a texture to it, so it's not all just. Okay. Um. Yeah. So parent that to the main camera. Um. Yeah. So this you can just create another camera to have like, you know, two different views, if you want. Okay. So because I know lots of first-person games have that, two different views. Okay, so we're gonna, yeah, we're gonna change the near clippings to one. Right, and we'll just back a little. I mean, it's not the perfect kind of thing, but uh, okay. So let's parent that to the capsule, right? And we can do camera switching. Right, parent that to the capsule. So camera one would be the main camera. And camera two, and second camera, and this is the last um, giveaway that I did with this. Um, so yeah, so camera one, camera two. So when we 
go into the game, it's gonna be this camera, and then we press C, it's gonna be here. So you know, lots of it's kind of funky though, but we gotta fix that. Huh, okay, I think it's because I don't know. Maybe this is me to be parented to this this camera. Okay, yeah, that's better. Yeah, so um, yeah, so you know, cause lots of first person shooter games they have two different views in there. So shoot, oops, it's, it's going to all the cameras. So yeah, so this tutorial, you know, hope you guys like, you know, and hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like and comment, you know, if you request any tutorials that you want me to do, you know, just comment down below, and I'll see you guys later. I'm call it out.